Hello, everyone. Welcome back. This is Freddie J here with Freddie J Sports. And today we're going to explore the wonderful world of Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2004. We last left off doing a couple of tutorials, and now we've earned our tour card, but I'm during instead of doing the tour right away, we're going to go and face off some challengers here so that way we can uh, level up. Let's first talk about our golfer here. Uh, we don't have a, a bio yet. But yes, we have our bronze tour card. We've unlocked 16 out of the 29 golfers. I mean, I haven't really played the game. We're, all, we're missing seven courses. You know, that's the, you know, seven courses we don't have a membership to. But, you know, again, we just started. We only did a tutorial. So we're, we're going to try to do what we can to, you know, start our progression towards, you know, becoming the greatest golfer of all time. Our longest drive right now is 287 yards. Our longest putt, 8 feet. But, let's see what we can do about that. Oh yeah, they're not counting any of these. So we can't do any of the real-time events unless we change the clock. So we're going to start the world tour. This is something that I mentioned in, actually, this was actually part of the video I was working on where I was doing the play now scenario, but I decided not to because we was terrible and we, we needed our stats up before I tried something like that. So yeah, let's not do that. So we're going to try the world tour, start off a little simple. Uh, let's see here. Let's try our hand on sunshine. Yeah, let, let's, let's go on the West Coast. I don't think we should head home yet. Going to the Northwest. We're going to do the front nine of Poppy Hills. This is tour stop one. Of, you know, the Northwest. Shout out to the Northwest, though. Like, honestly. Would you like to place a wager on this match? I, 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 I can't. I'm, I'm broke. I, 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 I don't know what to tell you. Let's just say that Val Summers has a temper and she knows how to use it. Or, as some of her rivals would say, she knows how to lose it. Hey, even I have to admit that she's a pretty good golfer, especially for someone as pampered as she's been. Let the facts speak for themselves. This Beverly Hills daughter of the famous Hollywood producer has a very good golf game. A word. We'll see about that. I didn't even adjust my uh, swing or anything like that. Not that it matters right now, because, you know, I'm still technically, according to the game, still fairly young. So let's go ahead and get going. Val Summers is our next competitor in the world tour. If she can keep her cool on the course, she'll be very tough to beat. She also happens to have one of the best short games of any of our challengers. So don't count her out of any hole. All right. And so now on the tee from North Carolina. It's Freddy. Every time I say North Carolina, though, like, freaking... I keep looking back at the Hardy Boys and, like, the announcers back, you know, if you ever watched uh, SmackDown or Raw or, you know, WWE, 
like they they always make a point to to be like hey they're from north carolina and i'm like oh okay like literally you know 10 percent of the population <laughs> actually care it's me i'm 10 percent of the population All right, we could we could play this. We 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 got this. 171 yards. On the tee from Beverly Hills, California, Val Sunshine Summer. All right, that's a great tee shot right there. Two hundred and thirty one yards. Of course, there's no voice acting right now. Uh, there there's some in the later games but uh let's go ahead and try that punch shot right in the sand hey 83 yards to the pin we're out of the thick of it would that count Should be happy with this approach. All right, thirteen feet for sunshine. All right, let's see what I can do here. I don't have a lot. This is gonna take. Man. So we're probably going to lose this hole unless Sunshine is very terrible at putting. Blurted with caught the bunker but shouldn't have much trouble advancing the ball from here. All right. Well, Sunshine 13 feet for the hole. Quite sure that that's what uh, we had in mind here. She'll get the par, and that'll be it. All right, so I go down one. It's okay. We got a par three coming up. Let's see how she handles it. The first of five par threes incorporates two greens for variable length to the hole. Note that the left green is uphill and thus plays longer than the actual yardage. Um, uh, they totally did that flyby on the wrong green, but we, we'll, we'll let it slide, I guess. Ooh, that's not gonna make it. Pulled it right oh. the tall stuff. Just throw the club on the ground. All right, you're uphill. Well, that is not going to be in the short stuff. Well, finding. Uh, well, at least I made it. That's in the long stuff. Like I didn't hit it short. I just missed the right and short. But you know, if if it was straight on, it would bounce a little bit. That's a good shot right there. So now I have to do better. Six feet. Fifty-eight degree wedge here, right in between the strong and the weak side wedges. There we go. Four feet. Get wrecked. Listen, at a bogey. Sunshine for par. Ooh. That was close. <laughs> it's par. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, make it back to even. I, I could. Unless. Yeah, that's straight in. Bye. Got it up and down for par. 
All square after two. This is best of nine holes, by the way. So, you know, this is going to be a short video. I might even do a double header depending on how I feel. But honestly, it is going to be a short video. The third hole at Poppy Hills is a dog leg to the left, which forces a tee shot of at least 215 yards to clear the corner. The approach shot is uphill to a two-tiered, severely sloped green. Placing the ball below the flagstick is a must here. All right, let's look at it. Oh no, I went the wrong way. Bank. I went the wrong way. <laughs> Here's sunshine. That's definitely going to be on the fairway. Unless it rolls too much, but yeah, that's still on. Alright, it's time to work on me being an escape artist. Uh, where do I want to aim this? Honestly, right there. Uh, two iron and hope. I think it was a good decision to go for that shot. Well, I had no other option. I mean, I could have laid it up, but, you know, I, I wanted to at least get some more forward yards. See? Even she's short. I, you know, I could do something about it. And here we go. Third shot. We're 42 yards uh, away from... Our location that we need to put it. I'm gonna do the patented flop again. Ooh, we're gonna have to. Ooh, let's. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good shot. It's not as close as Sunshine might put it, but you know we're 11 feet. Depending on the spot, we might have a good roll in. Yeah, she's 12 yards off. This, this, she could probably hold it out if, you know, the rumors are true. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, that's short. All right, so we might. We saved par by making this one. We saved par here. This is a. Gary, the right speed and the right line, and you got it. Can, can I? Yes, that'll usually work. Can, can I talk, please? Thank you. So. You know, this one's a tough one, but, you know, if I could save par here, then, you know, that gives me better chances to, uh... Keep it square. Did it! Amazing, brother! Pop out only on occasions, brother. This is nine feet. Now, ball is on her court. Let's see if she makes it. Nice recovery for Paul. The hole is halved. First of five par fives at Poppy Hills is a double dog leg swinging to the right and then back to the left. The tee shot should be played down the left side and a second of 195 yards to the second turn. A short third is left to the largest green on the golf course. This green is pitched sharply from back to front. The fourth hole is by no means an easy birdie. All right. An easy birdie. You don't think I can make it? 
I mean, I don't think I've scored a birdie all game. No complaints about this one. Unless that was very low. We need to work on that ball flight. I'll tell you what. 244 yards right there. Now here comes Sunshine. Still all square. Not her best effort, but it's safe. Was that a punch? 151 yards. You might as well bring out a pitching wedge or something. Going with the driver here. Chance to get it close. That is not close. This won't be easy. Right about that. About 230 to the hole. All right, 230. A par five. This is a par five too. Okay, what was that? We fought our way through the trees and still made it on the fairway, so Hey. <laughs> Sunshine, 100 yards out. On a third shot. Should have a good chance from there. That is a really good not shot. Shabby, not a great shot, but we're putting. Go ahead and hit a flop. Don't want this one to get away. Oh, I could have done a lot more. Hey, I got a hundred dollars. Tell me, David. Well, I'll tell you more after the stroke. Can I read it then? Not. I, I need. I need. I need some assistance here, cause you know, this one's a weird-looking one. But, you know, I'm going to go with my gut and see that's uh, two feet left and uh, six feet long. And go from birdie from 19 feet. That one's short, but honestly, it is what it is. We get the par and, you know, move on from there. Val Summers for birdie. Or the hole. Couldn't do it either. So far, even through four, as we head on to the fifth, it's going to be a par four, 337 yards, it looks like. The fifth is a straight golf hole, which provides the first look at water on the golf course. The approach is usually from a downhill lie, causing the ball to slide from left to right, thus bringing the leg very much into play. All right, so uh, let's see what we can. This one is easily drivable if I hit this right, but again, I have to hit it right. Give me something good here. Two hundred and ninety-one yards. A good drive. Now here's sunshine. What are those? Seriously, what shoes are she wearing? So I definitely won the long range of contests. 
This will end up in the green. And here it is. Our second shot with Freddie here. Rocking the all black Nike outfit. That's a little bit to the right. Hey, we'll take it. All right, this is for birdie. Well, this one's pretty stock here. Put a good stroke on it. Got a good chance of making it. All right, this is for birdie. That did not break. Interesting. Makes his par. All right, hopefully that's not detrimental to us losing this hole. Sunshine, 11 feet. Wow. All right. So at the fifth, Sunshine goes back to one up. But well, we got a par three, so let's see how she does. And how well I do. The sixth hole is an innocent looking par three, but large bunkers left, right, and short can put a skid mark on your scorecard. Tall pines help block the prevailing headwind, but don't let that fool you. Once the ball gets above the tree line here, that wind might wreak havoc with your tee shot. All right, so this one's 131 yards. I don't like that angle. That one's... Ooh. All right, my turn. Oh, yeah. We might get our shot back right here to make it all square again. Sunshine, 19 yards out, off the green, on the rough. That one's left. That's going to roll a bit. Long putt up ahead, 21 feet. Val Summers, four par. I saw what happened there. It looked like it was going to turn, but then it just decided to change its mind right there at the end. This one... You need a little bit of luck to make it. Oh, wow. It just ran right over the hole. That That was like right there too I wouldn't necessarily say I blew it Needs to drain this but uh yeah we probably could have slowed it down Bogey there not exactly what the doctor ordered we still have one more shot to win this hole won the hole Yep, like that. All right, even three holes left to decide for a winner. The seven of the Poppy Hills is an uphill sweeping dog leg left with a fairway that falls off to the right and is guarded on the left by a bunker. The second shot is all uphill to a green sloping from front to back. All right, let's see what we can do here. Three hundred and thirteen yards. Oh, 
surprised that this one catches the rut. I was so close to turning it back. But we did get a big chunk of change right there. 60 yards left on that one. This one's lacking in distance, but it's straight. Two hundred and eighteen yards, that barely landed on the fairway. Not where you need it, but it's something. Tiptoed on the green. Let's see what Sunshine does. Third shot, 11 yards. Unbelievable. This was exactly what we were looking for. This to have the hole. Oh man, that's gonna be tough to have it. Hmm. If I could pull this off, this is an ugly turner too. Yeah. Honestly, she deserved that one. I can, you know, like she hold out from like. Hey. What up with two left? I gotta make sure I go hard the next two holes. The first of four sharp dog leg holes. The eighth is a par four that requires a tee shot of 225 yards down the left side of the fairway. The green is two tiered with the tier running perpendicular to the approach. Sunshine up one with two holes remaining. All right, 169 right there. Here I go. The fairway there we go. Got some extra yardage right there. That's what we need. 232 yards. This is on the green. All right, 18 feet. Nice job for Sunshine. And it nicely for the green. Not a lot of movement. Summers with the birdie opportunity. Hmm. All right, I gotta put this one in. I I can't play around with this. Oh, are you 
kidding me? Get too far. This puddle half the hole. This is gonna be tough. I now have to force extra holes. It's now Dormy 1 for Sunshine. This is not how I wanted to come out. However, last one's a par 5, so we... we opportunities here. The inward hole in the front nine at Poppy Hill is reachable for the long players with a drive aimed between the two fairway bunkers. As designed, the drive should be played up to the right of the bunkers and the approach across the quarter to the deepest green on the golf course. All right. Oh man, that barely escaped the rough. We need a lot here. I'll risk it all for it. The cord, look at this one fly. Beautiful looking shot. I think that will do the trick right there. I'll definitely do the trick. 266. Sunshine had to, had to hit a long one. I don't think that's making it. It's about time to play in the sand. We're in the bunker, I'm afraid. <sighs> All right. David, what's the situation? I'm thinking about a buck 70 to the hole here. We need this one. We need to get on the green and we need to we need to put it close to have a shot to stay alive. That is scary. Looks like it'll find the we, we we blew it, but we're a lot closer than Sunshine. But Sunshine, you know, can't count her out. That one looked very short, but it's still running. 21. 21 feet to the pin. Fasten your safety belt, sports fans. We're in for a bumpy one on this shot. Oh no. Here McCord if he's going to extricate it from this stuff. It's thick. This for the match. 21 feet. This to win the match. Whoa! I was not expecting that. Wow! Choked it from five feet. That was unexpected. To stay alive. This is the last putt. You miss this, it's over. How do you read this one? Yeah, it's not difficult to see that this one's going hard left. Nice par on that hole. If you like and we stayed alive. That was a nasty bender, but we got it done. Now we're going to extra. The players are tied. Way to make it dramatic on our first World Tour event. And now here we are going back to the third. And see what happens. Val Summers is our next competitor in the World Tour. 
If she can keep her cool on the court, she'll be very tough to beat. She also happens to have one of the best short games of any of our challenges. So don't count her out of any hole. Well, we have a chance to redeem ourselves. Let's see if that's good enough. Not a big hit, but it should be in the fairway. We'll make it a big hit. 226, that's good. Now here's Sunshine. That was extra. Got outdriven there. It's getting rough out there. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Hanged on. Not the best look. Sunshine. Also short. All right. Oh, my goodness. All right. Sunshine can make par. Oh no! Blew it from four feet. Oh no! That's tough. Clinch the match. Freddy for the win. Yeah, a nice wee bender. It's gonna go hard left. This is for the win here. It's Seven inches right, ten inches long. Got it! Wins it! Took ten holes to do it! Outstanding! Just won the first World Tour match. Unlocked the dream hole. And Val Sunshine Summers. That was a dramatic fashion win right there. That, that was very... Sunshine blowing that one twice there at the end was very interesting. But honestly, you know, to keep our composure and, you know, try to finish strong... You know, we, we have a lot we got to do here, probably, you know, towards getting our attributes up and whatnot. But hey, it's our first World Tour match. We've won barely, but, you know, we'll take it from there. So tune in next time as we face another opponent here, as uh, we look at some of the, you know, totals here. Got 500 from the pre-round stuff. And all, all of a sudden, we won like 67, like almost 66, sorry, I can't even math, $76,000 just for that match. So I'm like, hey, you know, that's a lot of stuff we could uh, help with our attributes with. I might get some clubs later, but, you know, it'll, it'll be a mixture of clubs as well as, you know, you know, our attributes, because, you know, that, that is a key factor in bettering ourselves in this game.
All right, so let's go ahead and look at some of the stuff right here. All right, so let's go ahead and... Now, normally, I'll be aggressive and go for power, power boots and whatnot. But knowing how I'm playing, I'm definitely going to go towards more of the accuracy. Um, let's go ahead and get some of that driving up. So uh, go ahead and get that ball striking to 25% approach recovery. Uh, definitely want to put some emphasis on there. Let's, let's see. Oh, that's at 25. Uh, let's see if we can uh, put everything at 30 before we... All right, let's, so, so let's keep everything at 25. Power boost is not really important, but spin luck, we'll, 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 we'll put some luck on our side. All right, so th this is going to be our attributes here. So for our next match, this is going to be our attributes. Uh, so far, well balanced in regards to all of the accuracy settings here. We're not going to worry too much about our power boost. Not because, you know... We don't need it. I, I, I know there's going to be courses where we're going to need our power and whatnot, especially right away. But, like, I want to make sure I get the accuracy down so that way, you know, when it comes to ball striking, driving accuracy. Because, you know, I know how to, you know, hit my joystick straight. But I want to make sure everything else gets, you know, put into the place as well. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's definitely something I'm going to be looking at. So that's going to uh, do it for uh, this episode of our world tour here at um, Tiger Woods uh, PGA Tour 2004. And tune in next time as let's look and see who we got to do. Let me go ahead and do this real quick. So our next champion is going to be the one and only John Daly. That is going to be very interesting. The good old rip it and grip it. That is going to be very interesting as uh, we uh, continue our stop at the Northwest Tour. But yes, thank you so much everyone for coming out. And as always, I'm Freddie J. You have a good day and a better tomorrow. Until next time.